And welcome back. Would you know what to do if someone near you collapsed suddenly? Thankfully, thankfully, brother, for a local man, those around him did, and now he's able to tell that tale. Will you? It gives us a story that may just inspire you <laughs> to learn CPR. I was uh, at the gym uh, doing some workout. 44-year-old Elias Abu Nassif used to work out four to five times a week in perfect health, or at least that's what he thought. Uh, suddenly I feel like a blurry vision and uh, then uh, I, uh, I passed out. In the blink of an eye, Elias was out, a cardiac arrest. Luckily, someone at the gym knew CPR and acted quickly. Without the, the CPR and without the AAD, uh, it was like, uh, it, it wasn't feasible to, 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 to survive. They saved my life. While the heart catheterization and the stent procedure is the thing that I think is most directly seen by patients as the thing that helped them out, frankly, it was the bystander CPR, which is the primary reason that he is alive today. The CPR and AED machine saved Elias' life and saved his family from being devastated. Because I have a child uh, that is like nine months years old now. Uh, the only thing that I thought about when I knew that I have a cardiac arrest was my son and my family. Doctors placed a stent in Elias's heart to reopen the blocked artery. And now in the middle of coronary rehab, he's thinking about getting CPR training himself. Through compression, compressions on the chest are able to save a person's life. A way to pay it forward. So if someone needs him to step in down the road, he can give someone else this second chance at life. I appreciate things more, for sure. People who have an out-of-hospital cardiac arrest, they have on average a less than 10% chance of survival without CPR by bystanders. Life is uh, very thin. You don't know how, how it's fragile uh, until you, you pass by such experience. If the story inspired you to want to be prepared in case something happens to someone near you, you can get an AED machine like the gym uses. They usually run from several hundreds up to a little over a thousand dollars, so that may work for some companies. But as an individual, if you'd like to take a class, there are many places around Cleveland that offer them, like AMA, some fire stations. Cleveland Clinic also offers certification as well. Russ, Betsy. Thank <laughs> you.